I have many sick and injured here, mate. They're crazy with fear. Tell me where you are. Where are you? You there, mate? Hello? Hello? I mean, of course you can. You can do anything. Duke! Pull the brake! Come on! Pull it again! And fertility. Come on, pull it. The size of my bust equates my aptitude as a goddess. With such logic, it can be said you and Neptune are the least fitting. The hell's that? Where Listen to squad's that achievements topic. until I took office. Your service to the Republic has been truly remarkable. For your meritorious actions and unequaled valor in service of the Republic, you are hereby awarded our highest honor. Wait, no, something's wrong. No, you don't want to go up there. A dragon, it's attacking! Well, I don't know. Not yet. It flew over the town and landed on the old dragon mound. I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not waiting around to find out. Come on. Star Wars The Old Republic The primary innovation Bioware touted about Star Wars The Old Republic was the comprehensive voice acting for every line in the game. Now admittedly, the performances of the individual actors may not be as terrible as in some other games, but several factors cause shit to seriously hit the fan. The focus of much of the pre-release development commentary, and the purported millions spent achieving it, set too high an expectation for a nice-to-have feature that nobody really cared about. I mean, seriously, n nobody cared. Other aspects hindered the impact of the costly voice work. Conversation wheels cause cutscenes to feel disjointed and jarring. Script writers naturally turned Star Wars into another Bioware romance simulator. And of course, switching voice actors for the same character in the middle of a goddamn cutscene. What really set the voice acting in the Old Republic below the rest is the overcompensation of resources toward an ultimately disappointing gimmick, which resulted in a gross neglect of the rest of the game. It's everything much more powerful. We see games as an art form, and we want to create a story that rivals cinema and novels. Who's calling the shots here? I'm Captain Revenant Orzik. I'm pretty sure I know what this is about. For the record, I take complete responsibility for my actions. You disobeyed a direct order from Grand Moff Kilrun. Yes, I had no idea he'd respond this brutally. Maybe he just hates me. You're, you're listening to these characters, and you're chatting amongst them, and you're playing...